Hello everyone. Welcome back to the another new topic on Microsoft Azure. In the last session, we have created our standard logic app using Azure portal. And in this session, we will understand how to create a standard logic app using ARM template. So if you remember, in the last session, we have downloaded this template file. So if you can see, we have this template.g file that we have downloaded. If you have missed to download this template.zip file, don't worry, you can go in Azure portal and you can go to the resource group. We can open the standard logic app that we have created. Click on that and in the left panel, we can go under the automation section. We have export template. So just click on that. It is generating the template. It will take some time to generate the template. Make sure you selected the include parameters checkbox. By default, it will be uh, selected. Template has been generated. We just need to click on download and it will download the template. Okay, so template has been downloaded. Let's go back. Now we have this template. I, I'll use the template that I have already downloaded. I'll extract it. So we have this parameter.json file and template.json file. Let's open the parameter.json file. If you can see, these are the parameters files. Okay, so if you can see, we have these parameters. Inside these parameters, all the values, all the parameters, variable, we don't have any variable. And then in the, under the resource, we have all the details. So this is template.json file. Similarly, let's see in the parameter.json file what we have. So in parameter.json file, we have these values. Okay, so we'll keep as it is. And the only thing that we have to change is name. Okay, so let's change it to ARM. Okay, so now we have this temp parameter file ready. Let's save it. Now what we have to do, we have to open open the PowerShell. Okay, so just open the Azure PowerShell and type az login. So it will log into the, it will open the pop default browser. You just have to select that and it will show you this message. After login, all the information about your subscription and tenant information will be appeared here. Now what we have to do, we have to just type az space deployment space group space create and then we have to pass subscription and then here you have to pass the subscription details. So what we can do, we can go to the Azure portal. Okay, let's open the standard logic app and here you can take that a subscription ID and you can pass that subscription id here you can pass the subscription name also but uh, that is fine you can pass the subscription id then pass the resource name information so here we'll pass again we'll go to the azure portal we'll take the resource group name and we'll pass it here after that we have to pass the parameter location so where we have this parameter file saved you just have to pass the location of that parameter file so let's open the notepad plus plus let's take the full file path name and i'll pass it here then i have to pass the template information like where we have this template.json file saved okay so in my case parameter.json and template.json at the same location i'll take the full path i'll go back i'll pass it here and then you just press enter once you press enter it will take some time to uh, create this standard logic app so let's wait to create that so if you can see it's already started it's showing running so it started creating the standard logic app and within a minute it should complete it okay so if you can see we have this one is complete the process is completed let's see our standard logic app name and see this is the standard logic app name that we have given in the parameter file Okay, now we'll go on Azure portal and let's verify. Let's refresh this resource group. 
and yes here we have our new standard logic app that we have created using arm template let's open it and we have all the information mentioned here status is in running okay so uh, that's it about the session in this way we can create our standard logic app using the arm template in case if you have any doubt or any query please feel free to contact contact me or you can add a comment thanks for watching have a great day